Hi and welcome back to today's more report on Friday the 15th of May with me Rich Perry Market Analyst at Handtech Markets. Moving on to Euro dollar now and this Euro chart has broken out to a certain extent uh, you would argue after three days positive candles in a row um, and you've seen a close above the, re uh, the previous resistance at 1390 uh, yesterday saw that close up but you've seen a, uh, the beginnings of a corrective move back today um, I would say that um, I'm going to be using any dips as buying opportunities on euro so I'll just hold off for this for a little bit just see how this correction plays out but you'd say that the momentum indicators remain all in positive configuration at the moment so I, th I don't think this is anything too significant to get worked up about yet but just wait for it to play out potentially. This is the hourly chart and we're seeing a fairly choppy start to the European trading session. Big strong candles either way and then last couple of hours we've started to get a bit of direction finally. Um, we could now see a correction back potentially um, it seems as though towards 13.38 which was the, the sort of intraday low a couple of days ago um, and that is obviously your initial support and then obviously the breakout level around that 12.90 level are the two levels that I'd be looking out for. In an ideal world, you'd probably be looking for a um, uh, an element of support to come in around that 1290 level, because that is sort of this um, this sort of breakout support that you've got, um, and uh, you'd also be uh, above the moving averages still on the hourly chart. But look at this. Um, these momentum indicators just rolling over, turning far more corrective. You've got this bearish divergence on the uh, on the pushed to the higher yesterday and uh, it looks as though there is a bit of a correction setting in and um, you could well see as I said further downside uh, in this one today as the euro just comes off the top a little bit I'd um, as I said I'd wait out um, for this to play out because I think you're gonna get uh, another chance to buy I think the euro hasn't yet finished its rally um, yet and I think um, you'd be looking out for a buy signal probably as I said between that um, 1290 and 1340 um, support area uh, on this chart but at the moment very near term there's a bit of a correction going on and uh, I just would wait for that to play out to, before you look for any more long positions um, yeah and um, what you'd be looking out for I think is obviously you've got the key support that comes in at 11.30 you certainly wouldn't want um, euro falling below that because that is your latest key reaction low within the bull run um, and that is a big low 11.30 now so um, ideally you'd be getting that um, buy signal around about the 12.90 area so I wish you good luck in your trading on euro today and I'll speak to you later